Yo, yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy, Grandma Goose. Get rich and move on. If you're new to my channel, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe button, all that stuff, right? So, we got Brittany Griner, right? They are uh, Russian courts just sentenced her to nine years in prison, which is a lot of time for some fucking hash oil, right? But I'm making this video to kind of let y'all know that it's a bigger message to this, right? Um, for me, it's not really political, although you could go down that rabbit hole if you want to and say that this has to do with the war in Ukraine and because of all of this stuff going on with Russia and everything, that this is why they're giving Britney Griner nine years, right? But they have um, a different legal system than America. This is I'm making this video to make y'all understand about when you travel abroad, it's not like America, okay? They have a completely different legal system, right? And Russia has a 99% conviction rate. They got a higher conviction rate than the feds in America, bro. Okay? 99% conviction rate. Meaning if they lock you up, chances are you're going to do time in their prisons. Because they already got the evidence that they need to lock you up. Brittany Griner had hash oil, right? Um, I just had this debate with somebody on Facebook about hash oil. Now, again, doesn't matter the amount. Uh, there, it don't really matter the amount. In America, it matters the amount. But even under in Texas, under one gram of hash oil is considered a a, a, a three a class three felony or a class C felony in uh, a, other states. So it is a felony in America to have hash oil. It's not just a felony out of out in Russia. So what I'm saying is that would have happened that. Most airports in America, she would have got the same detention and the same uh, process through the legal system. Now, the difference between America and Russia is the amount of time that's associated with certain type of crimes and felonies and things of that nature. Because now, if you're asking me my personal opinion, I think that is foul. I mean, it's a little bit of hash oil. Where I come from, I'm smoking weed right now. Where I'm at, it's legal. So it's, it's legal to possess, it's legal to have smoke in public places where you can smoke cigarettes and all of that. So I get it. Like, that's the catch-22 to it. It's like, damn, in America where I'm at, it's barely, it's barely illegal. It's still illegal federally, but it's legal on state levels and, and, and a lot of percentage of the states in America. But the laws work different. I'm, I'm making this video. I'm about to get out of here. It's Grandma Goose. I'm about to get out of here. The laws are different in different countries, y'all. They are. And if we just keeping it a, a band, we not liked as Americans in a lot of other places around the world, man. They don't really fuck with us like that. So the best thing would be if you're going to go on vacation there or be having to do a job there or work there and know that you have to travel back and forth between the airports, it's just to not carry drugs. They say, she's saying that she did it by mistake. She didn't know that it was on her bag. Um... I don't want to speculate on whether she knew or not because I know what I pack in my bags when I go on vacation or when I go to the airport. I make sure certain things I just don't put in my bag. That's just me. So I don't want to speak for her on that. But she claimed she didn't know what was in her bag. So that's so. But they didn't care about that. In Russia, they don't care about that. They got their own laws. They have minimum sentencing guidelines just like the feds do. And they going to give you whatever time that they want to give you with a 99% conviction rate. That's how the laws work in Russia. Don't get locked up in Russia, Americans. That's simple. Not like that, but I feel bad for Brittany Griner, nine years. She was in the height of her WNBA career, all of that. You know what I'm saying? She's going to play in Russia overseas during the offseason to make extra money. So it's like, it's not like they don't know who she is. So that's kind of like mind-boggling to me. It's like, damn, she one of y'all own. She played for y'all team. They're not going to love rock, but it is what it is, man. America, we not good nowhere else except for here. And we got to understand that abroad, the laws is a lot bit differently outside of the United States. That's simple. It's Grandma Goose, and I'm out. One. Free Britney Griner, though, because it's, it's not right for nobody to get nine years for a little bit of fucking weed on you. Come on, now.